Abby Ellis, the Aussie on this Boilermaker team, the first Australian in Purdue history as that is a three ball that goes. It's Jillian Herter. Rutgers putting on some pressure, the three quarter court press. Terry driving inside, the Euro step is blocked by Cassandra Brown, and that's a loose ball, we'll see how they call it. Terry to Ellis. Laid in from the corner, and sinks it. Sophie Swanson, another talented freshman for this Purdue team in the ball game, hesitates, drives in and pulls up. Rutgers is a team that out rebounds a lot. They're a plus five in the rebounding category as Swanson knocks that one down for two. That's because she tore her ACL in February of 2023, fought her way back and made her first career appearance against Southern Indiana. Terry with the rebound and this time the Boilermakers convert. Offensive rebound. A fresh 20 off the offensive board. Pedicord from deep. And she knocks it down. The second deep shot from Rutgers today. They're two of five. Adams over to Pedicord. Some shiftiness from Maya Pedicord and she puts it in for two against Wisconsin. She's 0 for 2 to start today. Herter with a long bomb. That goes! Purdue can't even get a shot off. What a way to end the half for Rutgers. The distributor of this Boilermaker offense. Two assists here today into Harper and she gets it off the glass. Knocked their field goal percentage up considerably. Both teams now shooting above 40% from the field. Madison Layton with an uncontested three. You cannot leave her open. Her second triple of the ball game and she's got 12. But Huter answers. Now Rutgers going back to that three quarter court pressure that they had in the first half. It was successful for a little while but this time the Boilermakers break that press. She's one for one here in the second. Terry finds Ellis uncontested. The Energizer Bunny strikes to Mary Ashley Stevenson. Driving inside again, working on that left hand and a turnover, oh excuse me, nearly a turnover. Stolen back by the Boilers. Roshunda Jones dribbles in, pulls up for a long two, rebounded by Layden. Dish out Harper uncontested. Terry with the dime, Harper with the triple. Terry finds Layden on the wing. Jones comes in from the corner, finds Mila Reynolds and one for the Boilermakers. And another offensive board as Cornwell couldn't handle it. Mary Ashley Stevenson for two. Smith to Stevenson in the corner. Adams in her face. Harper working through a double team, finds Layden with the backdoor cut. Thompson stuck between a rock and a hard place. Pedicord gets the and one for her team. With 13 and a half, and I, I should specify that's per league game, so in conference play. She leads the league in rebounds per game. A long shot from Herter, who has been money from deep. Nine point lead for Purdue. Terry intercepts that pass. Rashunda Jones, Boilers have numbers. Layden gets fouled and draws. And one for the Boilers. Spoke a little too soon. What a great shot coming from Thompson, working against some hard coverage and 40 seconds to play, Cornwell at the shoulder. Pedicard will pull up, and the jumper goes from the mid-range, it's a one point game. All you need is two. That one into Adams, she takes a dribble, puts up the shot, too strong off the glass, and the Boilermakers survive.